is Biani Bermudez. She is the assistant editor of Threads, the fashion section for Metrosphere magazine. She is also a writer and has a new blog called Heels and Feels, which I'm very excited about, uh, where she shares her fashion misadventures on and off campus. So please welcome Biani Bermudez. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Of guys. course. I'm so excited to have you. Your stuff in the magazine is um, some of my favorite work because you're very honest about yeah. your experience and you put yourself out there. Yeah. One example in particular, you put yourself out in a big way. You did a piece on dumpster diving yes. for beauty. Yes. And I did. Um, so let's talk about that. Yeah, that's me. I, I dumpster dive for makeup. <laughs> well, why don't you explain like what that actually okay, is, how that yeah. came about? So, so it was really my best friend who's as crazy as I am. I have her to thank for being in a dumpster at midnight one night. <laughs> well, we, we came across a bunch of YouTube videos of people finding like thousands of dollars worth of clean makeup. Wow. Yeah, in dumpsters. And I'm like, if I can say save that much money on makeup, yeah. then I'm, I'm going in the dumpster. Yeah, <laughs> so this is not free, right? It's this not, is a it's lot. It's so expensive. <laughs> I'm like, I can't afford all this all the time. So yeah. we always look for alternatives like that. So we are like, let's try it. These people are obviously getting some good stuff out of it. There has to be something in a dumpster for us. So See, I started dumpster diving years ago. <laughs> yeah. I guess I just wasn't looking for the right stuff. Yeah. No, we didn't even find any good stuff. So You didn't, so it was a bust. It was oh, definitely no. a bust. And yeah. that's when in the dumpster I realized is beauty really worth? You just have to keep <laughs> at it. You gotta keep trying. Yeah, I was Check like maybe it wasn't it wasn't trash day. We couldn't figure out when trash day was. So yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. So, How, oh, oh, go ahead. No, you go. How did you get into fashion in the first um, place? Oh my gosh, probably when <laughs> I, I was like you were born. born <laughs> I feel like she came out of the womb like, with an outfit on. And, oh my gosh. Yeah. Yeah, no, my mom was definitely a big influencer in that. When I was in preschool, she made all my clothes pretty much wow. because I was tiny, so it was really hard wow. to like find clothes for me that fit. <laughs> So she made a lot of my clothes, and I was always like most fashionable in every yearbook. And Love it. Yeah, that's where I came from. It was my mom. So thank oh, you, mom. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, mom. Yeah. Nice. And so you're gonna start um, a new. Actually, after this, you have yes. an adventure. <laughs> So we've Great moved from the dumpster now to a makeover. You're going to yes. go and get a makeover from a, a local professional. Yes. I'm mm -hmm. really excited about it. Um, I'm a control freak when it comes to my look, so this will be my first makeover and my first makeup artist touching my face. So. First? Really? Yeah. Oh. So you've never had anyone do your makeup before? Um, maybe when I was like 15 for my quinceanera. <laughs> <laughs> How'd that go? Yeah, it was okay, you know. Yeah. I hadn't really had makeup before so I was like gotta start somewhere mm -hmm. so that was the first time so today's yeah. really the the, tr the first time like I've been doing my own makeup now for a very long time so well, <laughs> and you do an amazing scary. job I always every time I see her in the office <laughs> um, I grill her about how she gets the perfect winged oh. eyeliner it looks yeah it takes practice I've been asking for that look I from know Deanna that I know that you've been hungering now, for that as well no one so. will help me <laughs> Maybe I'll, I'll help head you with out. You to the yeah, you should come with me. Okay, sounds like Okay. Fun. <laughs> and so your blog that's coming out, Heels and Feels, tell yeah. us about what that will feature and <laughs> what you're going to talk about. It's just going to be a fun blog with all of my misadventures and just making fun of myself because I think um, in this day and age we need some humor in our lives. I, I really didn't want to be serious about this blog. I didn't want to bring in a lot of serious um, stuff to it. So I just want to make people laugh and kind of, um, it's a lot about self-love too. I want people to like start looking at themselves and loving themselves and kind of stop worrying about what everybody thinks and taking it so serious because that was something that I struggled with a lot. So yeah. it's kind of my learning how to love myself and teaching people along the way. I love that. I, yeah. I, that's a great contribution and I think more laughter, yes, yeah. please. Yeah. So <laughs> well done. Um, so your blog will be on mymetmedia.com mm -hmm. under Metrosphere's blogs. Yep. Um, heels and feels, and then we will see you also in the, we'll get to see and read about the your makeover, makeover and how that yep. went <laughs> in the February issue yes. of Metrosphere magazine. No, I'm sorry. The March, March. Issue. March issue. In the February issue, issue you have a shopping online guide. Yeah, shopping how to get over your anxiety online. about online yeah. shopping. I actually find online shopping to be how I relieve anxiety. Yeah. Much to my husband's dismay. <laughs> hmm. I just let but, my mom handle that. So. There you go. Oh. <laughs> See, you need to learn how to online shop. <laughs> there you go. 
<laughs> you can teach me sometime. Exactly. Yeah. Read my article. <laughs> there you go. All right. Perfect. Well, thank you so much for coming on. Thank you, guys. Thank, thank you, you for much. having me.